Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is okay. My controller wasn't responding for a moment. This is Recore. Continuing my journey to figure out what is going on on this planet. Uh, my current quest: find three blue plugs, which are cute little buggers, I admit. But yeah, you know, it would be nice if they didn't wander away so often. Apparently, I have found a new arena map. And I did get a purple, so that is interesting. I uh, found a new arena map right there. There are some cores in some of these areas. I thought, I, yeah, I figured there was a core up there, but yeah. Hmm. Places, things that look like that's. Oh, Eden Tower. Okay. Huh. Looking at this, yeah, it looks like there's only four main areas. I mean, they're big areas, granted, but can I? I can't see Eden Tower. I think it's off that direction. So, finding four of those little okay. Well, let's see what I can do. Would someone lock up a bunch of cell bots? Okay. There's another one. So I'm guessing they're all going to be up in this area. So that's at least a plus. I'm not going to have to go some extraordinary distance to... Wait, what? Okay, so there's all three. I'm not entirely sure how I'm supposed to be getting up this. Because, I mean, clearly I can get up this easily enough. I can get up this easily enough. I guess the idea is that I'm supposed to do that. Don't worry, you're safe with me. I probably could have made it all the way over here to this thing, but eh. Okay, so. Okay, onward and upward. Okay, these are at least staying in position, so that's good. What? What? 
tunnel is blocked off. We'll have to find another way around. Have to find another way around. Um... What do you mean, other way around? Oh god. That way around, okay. Am I seriously doing this? I am seriously doing this. Whoa. Better watch my step. Yeah, you better. Mac, you might want to wait. Focus, Jewel. Great, there's a yellow dog down there. What am I doing? Tying my shoe? My do it doesn't even have laces! Okay, so I'm guessing if I do it right, I can probably get on top and probably get more stuff. Because I see there's more stuff up there. I don't see anything that looks like a... Scintillating. Oh, there's something over there, though. That might be. That might. Was that? Oh, a little green guy. What do you power, little green guy? Oh god! Oh, does he go over there? doesn't look like there's anything else over there and there's no way okay so the only way to reach where did the green guy go
Oh god, it's purple now. Exceptional extracted purple core. So I need a red, a green. Okay, this guy did already go in. And another green in order to get in this, whatever this is. Okay, here's another one of the greens. Hey, little buddy. You go straight back there, don't you? So, I don't know. I guess... I think there's one that hovers. I'm sure there's one that hovers. I guess you have to have that in order to use these steam vents, and that would probably propel me onto that block, but it has a prismatic core in it, so can't do that yet. I don't know that I can do this yet, honestly, and I don't see a red thing anywhere over here. Oh, and see, here's another one of these rails. can't do anything with, but I'm sure it propels me up that way, so okay. It's kind of like in Metroid, when you know a little bit about Metroid, when you played like Super Metroid and maybe the original, and by god, you really want to get to these places and you see the things, you see the things like, I need a missile to open this door. It, it really does capture that entirely. I need a missile to open this door, but I don't have missiles yet, so why? Okay, I'm... I'm guessing in order to open this, I have to get up there. Like, the red one is probably up there or something like that. Can I sneak my way up there? Can a sequence break? Totally cheated. <laughs> Splash. Okay, I may or may not make this. Ah, I made it. Okay, so I just need to figure out where the red one is. Where the red one is. Well, I mean, it's obviously not up here, because I got the other green one up here. Which means I have to get the... Have to get the red one from somewhere. Mac, dig in. <laughs> dig up a red one. Come on, come on, dig up a red one. Yes. That's oh, green. Oh, okay. Oh, this is a dungeon. But I can't do yet. So, <laughs> that was a whole lot of wasted time. Okay. 
Um, so to that end, I guess I'm just gonna come over here. And I can pick up that you item. Made it, Mac. And there's this yellow wolf that I'm gonna kill. Do it! You got a lot of No you don't. You're out of energy, Max. Max. Rush in there. Caution, my headset is starting to beep. Which may necessitate a pause at some point in the near future. Hey, that's a uh, flashing color. Oh. Oh, it's Violet. Okay, I'm supposed to be going that way, but I want to see what's over here. Lenses. You're beeping a lot faster. Maybe if you slow it down a little bit. Started, but still. Why are you on fire, Mac? Oh, there's a rail track, so it doesn't matter. Okay. There's a rail track there, too, that probably launches me over to it, because I can see it right there.
green, okay. Interesting that there are multicolored things. Okay, I'm gonna... This area... I'm going to ha I guess I must, because in order to get up there, I have to have that track, so... Where is... Oh, the, the signal's over here. Okay. So I'm guessing this distress signal is going to be a spider or something like that that I can recover. Because it's it's basically over here. Like, you can see it's... Oh, it, it's another... Oh. That's... No, it's just up ahead. Hang on. It's another crawler. Yes, it is. Oh, I've got other things all in the sand here. It's like minefield. Big wolf! Big wolf! Dash in. running out of space for cores, but some of them are very fancy. Which is probably what I should be looking for more than most anything else. Mac, wait. Yep, spider. <laughs> I activated my beacon five days ago. Your canine unit took a long time to find me. Is he all right? Mac? He's fine. He hasn't been affected by whatever's making the other bots go crazy. This whole planet's gone crazy. <sighs> oh! Kybrang, core maintenance. Jewel Adams. Atmospherics. I've been trying to scavenge parts to repair my leg, but we haven't been able to lower the big core bots close to our crawler. I can't move fast enough to hunt him down. And Seth? He's too scared to go out on his own. Well, if you want, Mac and I can find the things you need. Really? That'd be great. Here, take this. You'll need it more than me. Luke. <laughs> I've got a list of all the parts for my leg inside the crawler. I'll send it to you over the radio. Okay. This. Sure. And Jewel? I'm glad I'm not alone out here. Me too. Wait. Hey, Jewel, you read me? Okay, I've got blue firing mode. I hear you, Kai. Go ahead. The parts I need should be in the nearby Corbot hive. I'll mark it on the map for you. Okay, we're on our way. I like that they each have a different color. Oh, hi Violet. The only question I have is, is there anything on his crawler that I need? <coughs> By the way, his crawler, not the best condition. Take a quick moment here and plug in my headset. Just in case. Tried to do it during the cutscene, but uh it was going blind. So I 
Okay, yeah, that's pretty totaled. Don't know what kind of trouble you got yourself into, but your crawler is A, half buried, and B, not going anywhere. Okay, I just have to wonder. Looking at his, I mean, hers looks like actual feet, and she's just got braces with uh, stuff, so, you know. Oh, wait, I'm not, where am I going? Okay, I'm not going here, it's just up in this area, okay. Crawlers were meant to be temporary habitats. Once all the crews were awake, they were supposed to move into residential towers and other buildings closer to their work areas. Um, yeah, temporary habitats. I don't even know that I would call it that. That's just, yeah. Oh, it reflects. Apparently. Oh, actually, this is the area I'm supposed to go to. Okay. This must be the place. Hey, Kai, we're here. Great. The parts I need can only be found on hybrid spiders. Green ones. Sounds easy enough. Well, the problem is these guys don't like sunlight. So you'll have to search for them under the sand and dig them up. We got this. Right, Mac? Take a look around. Oh! Oh! You got the scent, Mac? I didn't think you could actually destroy those, so hey. Not the kind we're looking for. We want the green ones. Get him, Max. Darn it. Yeah, but I'll still take an exceptional orange sphere. Take a look, buddy. As long as they're actually randomly in places, and it's not the last goddamn one that I find, because there are a lot. A green there we one. Go. Okay. That's it. Let him have. It. Need one spring piston. Mac, dig in. Do I actually have to destroy them in order to get that? Maybe that's maybe that's my problem. Maybe I shouldn't collect the uh, potentially very useful. I mean, that's that's an exceptional one right there. That's a really good one. Maybe just destroy the next one. Let's go, Zap! Let him have it, Mac. Mac, charge! Almost out, almost out! There we go. That's the last part we need. Let's get him back to Kai.
Oh, everything reflects. Okay. Okay, they don't drop anything, that's for sure. Design the blue, yellow, and red cores personalities to suit a particular set of tasks. The hybrid cores were, by definition, more flexible and, I hoped, better suited to unexpected changes in mission parameters. this. This is perfect, Jewel. Thanks. I'm sorry. It's all right. You never seen a human with legs like this, huh? I'm one of the lucky ones. They were able to amputate before the infection spread. <laughs> Dust devil. Class three outbreak. Hit Chicago first, <laughs> spread from there. We evacuated to one of the safe zones. Not fast enough. How about you? East or West Coast? West. Southern Sector. Well, I heard that got bad. You lose anyone close? My mom. Now I'm sorry. It's all right. My dad and I, we looked after each other. We were going to come to Far Eden together, but he had to leave Earth on a different ship. He must be up in orbit then. Asleep with all the others, waiting for the terraforming to finish. Hey, Seth, can you dial it up a little? Here. This might help. Where did you find that core? I've actually found more than one, but I don't know what they are. They're called prismatic cores. Top secret mandate tech. I've only ever heard rumors about them. They fix the pylon, and they work on other Far Eden systems, too. If we find enough of them, maybe we can get the terraforming back on track. Or maybe do a whole lot more. I don't know for sure. But the core foundry might have the answers we need. I'll get my legs working and meet you there. In the meantime, Seth, you go with Jewel. Don't worry. You're safe with us. Right, Mac? Okay. Seth, we'll do it together. Okay, I can now do Seth hunting objectives. Reach a 15 combo. Okay, over here. 
Over here, Seth. Oh. Okay, so I can carry around two, but there's only one ever actually active. Come here, buddy. Seth, come on. Come on. Hmm. Okay. Uh, what I'm actually going to do first, and in a way, it's just being a dick. Let's do this, Violet. Is I'm going back to my crawler. And I'm going to change Seth. Because as a player, I know one of two things is going to happen in the short term. Either Kai is going to die, or Kai is no longer going to need Seth, which basically means he's going to die. Spoiler alert, I guess, but I mean, yeah. Plus, I need to get rid of all these very valuable cores. Oh my god, so much energy. So it's five energy to increase a stat one point. Can I? Oh no, it's it's always only him. Okay, well, that's a thing, I guess. Research blueprints for the SPDR, which I only have the red ones. But you know what? They kind of look like they're a little awesome. Okay, I don't I don't know what that does exactly. Oh, that's the weapons array. Okay, so that's that's the gun. I have I have the SPDR switches that I need for that, and I've got SPDR switches, and yeah, I've got more than enough of everything that I need to. Sweet. Aha! That did it. It worked. So awesome. Crafted ten parts. Awesome. Okay, so I'm going to go back to here, and Seth is getting a makeover. Is not level 13. Well, damn. <laughs> as soon as Seth is level 13, he is getting a makeover. Maybe not as soon. Eh, but, yeah. Okay, friendly cores, fusing them, etc., etc. I already got this. I'm guessing this is going to pop up every time for no reason at all. Wow. Mac. Just, wow. Okay. Um, apparently the spider defense is... The, the only problem with the spider is the energy levels. I'm not going to worry about that. I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead. Yeah, that's good enough. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to walk up to wherever my objective is in order to What's up, Violet? to get that ability. So, so we're heading back to the cradle. Where am I heading? I'm heading up here. No, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to go ahead and head here. Oh, that reminds me. I want to see if I can see Eden Tower, because apparently it's a thing, but is it underground? Ah, okay, so extracting your core will prevent it from dropping loot. So, you know, there's that. I'd say with over a thousand of all three types of fusion right now. Right now, I don't really need more. Yep, this is taking me to that pathway. Oh, the blue wolf is back. Excellent.
Instant extract. I didn't see what level that was, but I guarantee it's a good one. Uh, no, maybe not. It's level 7. Still, not that bad. Yeah, so here's my objective. I'm going to have to come over here and figure out this first. Attach. Let's go, Seth. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I guess Seth is not how I do the, the, the leaping thing. Anything else that I need? No. Not the leaping thing, the the gust of energy one. Well, that's that's another failure. It does also mean that I can fast track back to my crawler and get that extra prismatic core. Over here, Seth. <sighs> to me, Seth, give me a lift. doing we made it me scared no way Seth you were great okay so that's a short way up here I guess Okay. This is getting much, much more. I can barely see you guys on my crawler's cameras. You've got to be hundreds of feet above the ground. Don't worry, Seth. We got this. Why didn't I just go that way directly? Where? What? What? Okay, I'm just gonna have to do that later. Thing. And I'm just I'm just going to get down here. That's that's it. And then and then. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and run around here. Oh, see, that was worth it. This ought to be good. Okay. Ape legs and torso. So I'm guessing I'm going to get the ape soon, too. And I'm sure the ape is the one that you need to break this. 100% sure. Come to me. Just to double check. Yep, okay. Okay. 
Okay, this isn't going to get interesting at all. Teleport here. Or, okay, I can teleport the crawler. For some reason. Those evil robots in the movies we used to watch would always say, Humans are imperfect and dangerous. They must be destroyed. But that makes no sense. I mean, the robots are imperfect too, right? Otherwise, why would they attack us? What I mean is, Perfection. It's the wrong goal. What really matters is balance. So, when I started to design the AI for the cores, I didn't try to make a single perfect intelligence. Instead, I designed three separate personalities. A brave one, a fearful one, and a cheerful one. And to keep them straight, because <laughs> you know how messy I can be, I gave them different colors. Red, yellow, blue. And my hope was that, together, these personalities would form a balanced group. They wouldn't be perfect, <laughs> but they wouldn't try to destroy us either. Hmm. Okay. Um, I'm hoping this is a place where I can save, because it's about time, and I don't want to get too far ahead. Though I'm probably going to do another one, because... I really am enjoying this game. It's not a great game. It's not s s super or you know, fantastically written or anything like that. But it's it's just right. It's you know kind of like kind of like he just said. You know what? I'm going to do another one. Um, but kind of like kind of like the doctor just said. It's not perfect. But sometimes maybe that's not the goal. So for now. Uh, actually, you know what? I am absolutely sure that I'm not going to be able to... Yeah, I'm absolutely sure that I'm not going to be able to save in the middle of the foundry. So, I'm going to go ahead and enter the foundry. That's going to be the end of the video, and I'm going to stop for the night. So, I have six. That's excellent. That means I don't have to find another one. Which I would have had to find another one if I hadn't already uh, taken care of that. So that's, yeah. Uh, that was one of the complaints that uh, Zero Punctuation had about the game is like when you reach the end game point, it's like you do some stuff and then you hit a wall. Who's ready and that wall says you need more prismatic cores. So you do get more pr prismatic cores. And you do some stuff and you hit a wall. So, you know, yeah. So I'm hoping this saves. There's a little symbol on the bottom right that is uh, should indicate when something saves. Okay. Yep. You're looking for a device called the Core Analyzer. I don't have access to the Foundry blueprints, but I'll do my best to guide you there. Sounds good. Mac, Seth, let's go. Okay, so this is going to be it for today. And as usual, if you have any comments, suggestions, etc., please leave a comment. If you liked the video, please like, and have a good day.